The family of ex-Mungiki leader Mainan Jenga wants the government to produce their kin, who they claim was arrested by police officers on Wednesday night, but is yet to be produced in court. At the same time, Vihiga Senator Godfrey Osotsi says he is safe and free after evading a police dragnet on Friday. This coming a day when what appears to be part of the ongoing crackdown on government critics saw a break-in into Busia Senator Okeo Mtata's office on Saturday night by unknown people who made away with computers from his office. Martin Munene reports. The family of ex mungeki leader Maina Jenga is still looking for him after his alleged arrest on Wednesday night at his father's home in Matasia, Kajiado County. The family claims that Jenga was arrested around 9 p.m. four days ago, but is yet to be produced in court. The family wants the government to produce their kin, whose whereabouts are unknown, while maintaining that he's a victim of political witch hunt. <laughs> Sikari eudulise watoto yangu nyumbani kwa mani kusikutano sija waona. Na kama wana makosa, wapelekwa kotini, wawukumiwe, ama wakiliwe kufuatana na sheria ya serikali. The family is also asking the Azimio leadership to help them trace their loved one, while urging them not to hold the Wednesday demonstrations and instead focus on finding out Jenga's whereabouts. Tunaona kwa mitandao munatangaza kuna maandama wa siju Wednesday. Ni yanini maandama munatangaza ingine? Hatujui kiongozi wa Azimio moja pari ako. Kwa nini musifanya maandamano kwanza ashiliwe? Kwa nini hatuboni mukiingia kwa media mukiongea mmenyamaza kwa nini baba Laila umejificha wapi wewe karozo msioka uko wapi madha karowa wewe uko wapi wajakoya wewe uko wapi kwa nini hamuongei This coming at a time when Vihiga Senator Godfrey Osotsi declared that he was safe and free in a statement Osoto narrates how he escaped the police dragnet on Friday and went into hiding Osotsi claims that the plan to arrest him had been orchestrated by Kenya Kwanza leaders from the region on claims that he was planning to disrupt President William Ruto's functions in Western Kenya on Saturday. Elsewhere, unknown people raided Busia Senator Okia Omtata's office and made away with electronics and storage devices on Saturday night. According to the senator, it is not clear who committed the crime or even the motive behind the break-in. Senator Omtata has however maintained that all data relating to the ongoing case against the Controversial Finance Act are secure. Martin Monene, Citizen TV.